Plays to the corner for Koivu. Koivu. Down low to Pominville. Back to Koivu. Pominville now the only right-handed shot on the Minnesota power play. Gives it to Koivu. Center for Parisi. In they score! This is on the power play, but watch this feed right to the front of the net. This is intended for Zach Parisi, but a great read and a great follow-up by Suter. And this one just has eyes because it goes off a leg or the less. The Wild have a quick 1-0 lead in this one. Power play goal for Minnesota. 1-0 for the Wild. Score! And here's Nino Niederreiter in again. Niederreiter! Save Varlamov! Engine plays back down. Fontaine behind the net. Bump there. Chris crosses with Hollow. Fontaine centered. Loose puck. Hollow jamming away. It's still loose. Fontaine pulled down out front by Benoit. And the Avalanche clear to the line. Easy. Tried to go to the point to Suter, and it was intercepted. And the Avs will get a change as they come back to center. Ryan Suter overskated it. Parento drops it back. A shot saved by Kemper. McGinn fires another save by Kemper. Two big stops by the Minnesota goaltender. Highly along the boards. Down low to Parento. Parento with Scandellup nearby. Plays to the point. Across to O'Reilly. O'Reilly backpedals. Goes down low. Stastny to McGinn. Glove save by Kemper. Control of it at center. Parento's pass out of the reach of O'Reilly. And Scandella is back to recover for Minnesota. Had to battle to escape O'Reilly. O'Reilly now comes away with the puck. Drops it back to Ben. Oh, shot, pass, save, Kemper. In the play. Jared Spurgeon back to pick it up for Minnesota. Scandella to Danny Heatley at center. Across for Brodziak. Brodziak around McKinnon. He's in. Saved by Varlamov. Dog into the Minnesota zone. Cuts to the middle. A shot goes high and wide. Rebound picked up by Granlund. Carries to center. Drops it to Parisi. Then to Pominville. Pominville across. Granlund fires. on this play. He is the key. He drives through the middle, and that clears everybody, including a spot for Granlin at the top of the circle. The Wild practice this before game two in Denver, and a big gaping five-hole there. Genin comes to center, deflected by Brodziak, and then dumped into the Minnesota zone. Dayton Stoner back to pick it up for the Wild. And walk across to Johnson. Johnson to the far side. Takes a return pass in the middle. Closing second. Stats need a Landeskog. A shot saved by Kemper. And the rebound scooped up. It's a three-on-one for Minnesota. Koivu just out of the box. Has McCormick driving the net. But his pass is intercepted. And from his knees, rings it around to the point where Suter has it. Suter to Pominville. Back to Suter. He fanned on it. O'Reilly and look out. Here's Stastny shorthanded. Stastny in alone. Scores in a shorthanded goal for Colorado. Cuts Minnesota's lead in half. Second in the league in shooting percentage. They get out shot on most nights. And this is how they come back in so many games. They find opportunity and they make them count with some of their skilled forwards. A shorthanded goal out of the penalty box. Has he been physical in this series? Howell starts back for Minnesota. Niederreiter as it's stripped away by Holt. Fontaine intercepts. Centers for Howla! Saved by Varlamov! By Benoit along the boards. Poked ahead by Prosser. Prosser hustling after it. Has Parisi with him. Slides it across, but it was in the skates of Pominville. Prosser knocks it out of the air. Brodziak fires. Saved by Varlamov! Parisi tied up. Couldn't get a backhander away. Into the Minnesota zone. Dropped it back. And the shot by Cleese deflected. Now Wilson pinching in from the point. Pestered by Heatley. McLeod on front. Loose puck. Scandella got just enough of it to break it up. O'Reilly to Duchesne. He centered him again. Who pushed it just wide. Parento to Duchesne. Down low. O'Reilly centers. Holden on the back door. Scores. And Colorado ties it with a power play goal. Clear. And it just stayed in the zone. They kept working it around and eventually got it to the back door for a, a nice speed. Holden gets a great pass there. Sit in the wild, get a change. They desperately needed that line change. They were running around their own zone and just couldn't get pucks out past the blue line. Icing waved off, and O'Reilly with a redirect. Saved by Kemper, he didn't know where it was.
has one man, then Stastny has the puck to Johnson at the point. Johnson's long one blocked out front and picked up by Spurgeon, who leads a three on three at center. Spurgeon at the Colorado line. Back pedals to the boards, fires on goal, save Varlama. Solid defensive play, and the Wild almost convert. Heatley pushed a backhander just wide. Brodine holds, long shot, saved by Lava! And on the rebound, Niederreiter fired wide. Flips it cross ice into the corner. He heads off. Charlie Coyle sends it out front. It's behind Koivu, and the Avalanche come back to center. Into the Minnesota zone. It's McKinnon with speed, but he fires wide. Blocked by Spurgeon. Eric Howla there for Minnesota. Howla plays it ahead. Out of the reach of McCormick. O'Reilly takes the return pass. Saved by Kemper. And then O'Reilly trying to jam it in. Coyle has it. Mike Yo shuffling his lines here. It's Coyle with Koivu and Parisi. Here's Parisi along the boards. Plays across to Suter. Suter's long shot just wide. Rebound. Suter holds. Fires again. Saved by Lamov. The line. Spurgeon holds the bouncing puck. Molson fires off the end glass. Johnson scoops it up in the corner. Sends Duchesne ahead. Duchesne with a full head of steam into the Minnesota zone. Drops it back for a shot by Parento. Wild get it to the line, but the abs hold. O'Reilly slams it into the corner for Duchesne. And the knee looks good there as he centers for O'Reilly. Johnson at the top of the circle fires. Loose puck poked away by Granlund. Howla forced to the outside by Wilson. Sends a backhander wide of the goal. Then tries to play it back for Heatley. Heatley trying to jump around Gennon. Heat in the second period. Throughout this series, the Wild have been careful with the puck. They have fewer giveaways than any team in the playoffs this year. Just 14 through the first five games. Pollenville wheels and fires. The net knocked loose. Offensive zone draw for Minnesota. Howler battling in the circle. Wild control. And a shot right on and a save by Marlama. Up with Koivu at the Minnesota line. Suter whips it across for Brodine. Brodine up ahead for Coyle. He deflects it into the Colorado zone. Coyle trying to duck under a hit by Johnson. Comes loose to the point. Brodine a shot save. Marlama. Back to Parento. Parento to Duchesne. Duchesne waiting. The end of the corner for O'Reilly. O'Reilly to Duchesne. Centers. Save. Kemper on the rebound. This fired high and wide by McGinn. Around behind for Gennon, whose pass got by Spurgeon, scooped up by Malone. Malone in, knocked down by Scandella. Malone then dumps Spurgeon. Paolo will draw for Minnesota against Stastny for Colorado. Up comes to Landeskog as his man tied up. Suter. Trying to hold at the point. Koivu joins the battle. Koivu fires. He scores! Parisi up front. And Minnesota leads. Net front presence. The Wild have had it in this hockey game on every one of their goals. And Parisi actually gets shoved by Barlama. And he pays him off with a deflection over his shoulder. He's ahead for Colorado. To Parento at the Minnesota line. Knocked away there by Spurgeon. Heavy hit thrown by Charlie Coyle right in front of the Minnesota bench. Abs have the puck, however. Landeskog to McKinnon a shot. Skips by him. Johnson down the boards to hold. Scandella for Minnesota to Parisi. Trying to slide it across. Howler has it to Pavinville at the empty net. Scores! But it might be one of the biggest ones of the series even though it was an empty net great play out of the zone Zach Parisi tied up his man and an empty net goal as Pominville uh, ices this one a minute 26 left a lot of time you'd think for an empty net goal but of course and each time the abs with an extra attacker goal iced it here's another empty netter for Minnesota as Scandella sends it the length of the ice five two Minnesota, and there will be a game seven in Denver. Karma about all kinds of things. The Wild had a few situations when the goaltender pulled before the Avs that didn't go their way. Less than five to go. Gennon fires wide. The Jabs continue involving Darcy Kemper. 
Stay away, young man. You've got a big start coming up in less than 48 hours. 